Hey guys, what's up? We're back with some more Warframe. Actually, da -da -da, I want to show off something that has I've just fully like acquired, so let's literally jump into it. There we go. Alright, that's everyone. Awesome. Oh, no, nope. one more left. There we go. Alrighty, so, what am I talking about? Well, I am talking about Pax Bolt. It is something that I have been trying to get. It's something that I think I made mention of when I made a quick review on the Gatekeeper's Judgment. So, Pax Bolt. Pax Bolt is an arcane quote well when it's rank three anyway on headshot kill you have a 50 percent chance for oh you can't see it because i'm probably blocking it yeah i am oh don't oh no oh no oh dear uh let's see okay so there we go uh on headshot kill 50 percent chance to for 30 percent ability efficiency plus 30 percent ability strength on the next ability used within four seconds so what does that mean it means that if i get a headshot kill there's a good to fair chance that i'm going to find something on the screen which is kind of why if you watch that particular fight again you'll probably see something show up and that's when i actually use my healing and because that's when i use my healing it's how i get a healing um rate of 102 as opposed to the standard 90 that I normally get after um, growing power so this stacks on top of growing power so having a weapon that does a decent amount of slash uh, status chance as well as having like really really high crit to do some really really good damage seems to be really good for this particular uh, uh, packs if you will now obviously because it's extra power strength that's why the healing increase but that also means that anything anything that is whoa any what's going on here anything that is related to power strength or is affected by power strength will be affected by pax bolt so what does that mean it means that your good old-fashioned attack mode limbo attack mode dark magician whenever he decides to show up give it time uh will also be affected by pax bolt so Come on, come on Warframe, come on, come on, there we go, that's the way, awesome, okay, so let's have a look at how that works out, so what we're going to do is we're going to try and drag everyone in here, and by drag I mean like we're going to try and bait them all in here to some extent, actually before I do that I'm probably going to want to get some energy. There we go. There we go. Now I have 700 and... Well, I had 700% extra damage in the form of like a serration, in the form of Rift Torrent, because this is attack mode limbo. So, yeah, this, this, this packs is real hot and spicy. The only thing is you need to like sort of keep an eye on your indicators in the top right because if you uh, don't realize that you've actually got a pack of gold you might accidentally waste it so that's no good And 
the last one. There we go. I would argue that it's a lot easier to use. Oh, hang on, we're missing one. So I believe that's only one dude, and as you can see with the extra power strength on my attack mode limbo build, I am now hitting 44% extra damage through Rift Torrent. Alright, I believe that is everyone. Awesome. Oh, come on, come on. Alright, so we're going to try one more thing. Because this is a headshot kill based uh, pack, we're going to use the might of the Staff of Armadillo, also known as the Scourge. But beforehand, what I'm going to do... Oh, actually, no, I'll start off with this. Let's, bra let's drag everyone in. Awesome, everyone's here. Like that. Apparently I'm not doing headshot kills, question mark. There we go. Do you believe that is in fact every question? No, nope, no, nope, not everyone. All right, that should be everyone. Anyway, yeah, that's it. So just again to reiterate, in conclusion, this is a pretty damn good packs to use, especially if you have like a caster warframe, a healing warframe, something like something that uses um some sort of energy over time, like damage over time or energy over time thing. Of course the efficiency only affects your initial cast, it doesn't actually affect any energy drain from something like renewal, but it will affect obviously the uh, amount of healing that you will do through renewal or the amount of uh, damage that you would do from something like World on Fire or uh, Chroma's Effigy, I would assume. I would basically assume this to be the case for everything that has some sort of energy over time or damage over time thing. Furthermore, it also affects all, well, I would assume it would affect all augments such as Rift Torrents, so it's very, very good to be used with someone who can CC everyone to stand still and have their heads popping out like well, not popping out, standing out, uh, like Limbo. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, hit the like button. If you really enjoyed it, maybe consider subscribing to the channel. And as per usual, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.